Imagine standing at the edge of a cliff, watching a waterfall plunge into the valley below. You feel it, not just the breeze on your face, but the invisible pull beneath your feet. Gravity. It's the silent architect of the cosmos. It sculpts galaxies from clouds of gas, binds moons to planets, and choreographs the celestial ballet of stars and worlds. But what is gravity? Truly, is it just a force pulling objects down, or is it something deeper? A warping of reality itself, stretching across the fabric of space-time. In this documentary, we'll journey from the falling apple of Isaac Newton to the bending light of Einstein's relativity. We'll explore how gravity shapes the very structure of the universe and why, despite being the weakest of the fundamental forces, it's the one that governs the destiny of everything. From the orbit of Earth to the collapse of stars into black holes, this is the story of gravity, the invisible thread that holds the universe together. The birth of a concept, Newton's gravitational revelation. It began, as many revolutions in thought do, with a simple question. Why does an apple fall from a tree? In the late 17th century, Isaac Newton, sitting in the English countryside, looked beyond the falling fruit and glimpsed a universal truth. The same force that pulls an apple toward the earth, he proposed, might also govern the motion of the moon, the planets, and the stars themselves. It was an audacious idea that a single law of nature could apply not just here on earth, but across the vast canvas of the cosmos. Newton called it universal gravitation, the notion that every object with mass attracts every other with a force that grows stronger with mass and weaker with distance. His law could be written as a simple equation, yet it described the clockwork of the heavens with astonishing precision. The orbits of the planets, the tides of the ocean, even the trajectory of a cannonball, all could be explained by this invisible thread pulling everything inward. And yet, as elegant as it was, Newton's law posed a deeper mystery. How did objects exert force across empty space? What was this invisible medium that allowed the Earth to reach out and hold the moon in orbit? Newton had no answer. I frame no hypotheses, he famously wrote. He had discovered the rules, but not the reason behind them. Still, it was a turning point. For the first time in history, humanity had glimpsed a grand unifying principle, a force that linked apples to planets, Earth to sky, and the human world to the universe beyond. Einstein's new vision, gravity as geometry. Two centuries after Newton, the universe spoke again, this time through the mind of Albert Einstein, and what it revealed was far stranger than anyone had imagined. By the early 20th century, scientists were puzzled. Mercury's orbit was drifting in a way Newton's laws couldn't fully explain. Light, which had no mass, seemed to bend around massive objects, and time itself appeared to behave differently depending on speed and gravity. Something fundamental was missing from the classical picture. Einstein offered a radical new answer in his general theory of relativity. Gravity, he proposed, wasn't really a force at all, it was geometry. Matter, he said, tells space how to curve, and space in turn tells matter how to move. Suddenly, the universe became a stage not of invisible forces, but of warped space-time, dynamic, flexible, and astonishingly real. Picture a stretched fabric with a heavy ball in the center. Place a smaller object nearby, and it rolls toward the depression. This is a 2D metaphor for what gravity is in Einstein's theory. The Earth doesn't orbit the sun because it's being pulled. It follows a curved path through space-time shaped by the sun's mass. This idea idea shattered our classical intuition. Time could slow down near massive objects. Space itself could be stretched or compressed. Black holes, regions where space-time is so warped that not even light can escape, were no longer science fiction, but inevitable consequences of the map. Einstein's vision was not just elegant, it was verified. When starlight was observed bending around the sun during a solar eclipse in 1919, the world watched science leap from chalkboard equations into the real, observable cosmos. In reimagining gravity, Einstein gave us a new lens to understand everything, from planetary orbits to the birth of the universe itself. Gravity was no longer just a pull. It was the very shape of reality, the weakest force with the strongest influence. It may come as a surprise, but gravity, the force that anchors us to the Earth, that shapes the trajectories of planets and birth stars, is the weakest of the four fundamental forces in nature. A simple fridge magnet, no bigger than your palm, can overpower the gravitational pull of an entire planet just to hold a paperclip in place. Electromagnetism, the strong nuclear force and the weak nuclear force all dominate at the microscopic scale, but gravity, for all its cosmic grandeur, is astonishingly feeble by comparison. The gravitational attraction between two people standing a metre apart is practically negligible. 
And yet, it is gravity that sculpts the grandest structures in the cosmos. It binds galaxies into spirals, clusters those galaxies into webs that span billions of light years, and drives the collapse of matter into stars and black holes. How can such a weak force exert such powerful influence? The answer lies in its reach and its nature. Unlike the other forces, gravity has no opposite. There is no such thing as negative mass. While electric charges cancel each other out, positive and negative, mass only attracts. Gravity always adds up. And because it operates over infinite distances, its effects are cumulative and unrelenting. Given enough mass and enough time, gravity can pull entire clouds of hydrogen into blazing stars, or compress stellar corpses into singularities. It is the ultimate long game, patient, persistent, and inevitable. In the grand cosmic arena, gravity may whisper instead of shout, but its voice carries the farthest. It is the quiet sculpture of galaxies, the soft architect of time, and the force that determines whether the universe expands forever or collapses back into itself. How gravity shapes the universe, step back far enough, beyond the stars, beyond the galaxies, and a hidden order begins to emerge. The universe, in all its sprawling complexity, is not random. It is structured, patterned, sculpted. And at the heart of this cosmic architecture lies gravity. In the earliest moments after the Big Bang, the universe was a dense, hot, chaotic soup of particles. There were no stars, no galaxies, just energy and potential. But even then, slight ripples of uneven density, quantum fluctuations magnified by inflation, created the seeds of structure, and gravity did the rest. Over billions of years, those slight irregularities became gravitational wells. Gas began to collect in the matter fell inward. Denser regions pulled in more material, growing stronger and more massive. It was a cosmic feedback loop, gravity shaping space, and space reshaping matter. Clouds of hydrogen collapsed under their own weight to ignite the first stars. Those stars grouped into galaxies, spiraling majestically through space. Galaxies gathered into clusters and clusters into superclusters, all held together by gravity's invisible hand. Even on the largest scales, the cosmic web of dark matter in galaxies, stretching across billions of light years, gravity dictates the form. It's as though the universe is a vast tapestry, and gravity is the weaver, pulling threads together into filaments nodes and voids. But gravity does more than build, it dictates fate. It determines whether galaxies will collide, whether stars will be born, or whether entire regions of space will remain forever dark and silent. It defines the cosmic boundary between what will fall together and what will drift apart. In the end, gravity isn't just a background actor in the story of the cosmos, it is the storyteller. And the universe is its unfolding epic driven and the fabric of time. In the everyday world, time feels constant. Seconds tick by, indifferent to where we are or how fast we're moving. But the universe, as Einstein revealed, has little regard for our intuitions. Time is not absolute. It is elastic, and gravity is the force that bends it. According to general relativity, gravity isn't just the warping of space. It is the warping of space-time. That means time itself flows differently depending on the strength of the gravitational field. The closer you are to a massive object, the slower time runs. This isn't science fiction, it's a measurable truth. In 1976, a hydrogen maser clock aboard a rocket was flown just 10,000 kilometers above Earth. When it returned, it was ticking faster than its twin on the ground. The difference was minute but real. And the stronger the gravity, the more extreme this effect becomes. Near a black hole, where space-time is contorted almost beyond recognition, time nearly stops for an outside observer. This isn't just a theoretical oddity. It's a doorway into the nature of reality itself. Time, the most fundamental experience we have, is not universal. It is shaped by where we are and what surrounds us. This phenomenon has practical consequences too. The satellites in the Global Positioning System, GPS, must account for time dilation both from their speed and their altitude, otherwise their location data would drift by kilometers every day. But beyond the technical, this realization is deeply philosophical. Gravity ties the flow of time to the fabric of the cosmos. It means that your experience of time is intimately linked to the great masses of the universe. You are not separate from the cosmos. You live within its rhythm. So the next time you look at your watch, remember, it is not the universe's time. It is yours, shaped subtly by the curve of the earth beneath your feet. Black holes. Gravity at its most extreme. Black holes are gravity's ultimate triumph and its most terrifying mystery. Born from the death throes of massive stars, 
These cosmic beasts warp space-time so violently that not even light can escape their grasp. Imagine compressing a mass greater than our sun into a region smaller than a city. The gravity becomes overwhelming. It tears space apart, creating a boundary called the event horizon, a point of no return. We cross it and nothing escapes. No light, no information, no hope. Black holes challenge everything we know about physics. At their core lies a singularity where densities become infinite and our current theories break down. Time itself, as seen by a distant observer, appears to freeze at the event horizon. From the black holes, perspective however the journey inward is swift and relentless far from mere cosmic vacuum cleaners black holes play a vital role in shaping galaxies supermassive black holes millions or billions of times the mass of the sun sit at the hearts of most galaxies including our own milky way their immense gravity influences star formation galactic evolution and even the behavior of dark matter. Recent breakthroughs, like the first ever image of a black hole shadow captured by the Event Horizon Telescope in 2019, have turned black holes from theoretical curiosities into observable realities. They are laboratories for testing the boundaries of physics and glimpsing the interplay between gravity, quantum mechanics, and space-time. In black holes, gravity reveals both its awe-inspiring power and its deepest mysteries, a force so strong it reshapes the very fabric of existence. Gravity waves, ripples in space-time. For centuries, gravity was thought of as a steady, unchanging force, until Einstein's equations hinted at something far more dynamic, ripples in the very fabric of space-time itself. These are gravitational waves, faint, stretching and squeeze and distortions traveling at the speed of light generated by some of the most violent black holes exploding stars or the birth of the universe imagine tossing a stone into a calm pond the ripples spread outward carrying energy across the surface gravitational waves are similar but instead of water the ripples propagate through the very geometry of space-time for decades, detecting these waves seemed impossible. Their effects are unimaginably tiny, distorting space by less than the width of proton over kilometers of distance. Yet, in 2015, the Laser Interferer Multigravitational Wave Observatory, LIGO, made history by capturing the faint echoes of two black holes merging over a billion light years away. This discovery opened a new window on the universe. Gravitational waves carry information about cataclysmic events that light cannot reveal. They offer a direct way to hear the cosmos, revealing hidden secrets about black holes, neutron stars, and the very structure of space-time. Gravitational waves are not just proof of Einstein's genius. They are a testament to the restless living universe, vibrating and evolving in ways we are only beginning to understand. Gravity and dark matter, the invisible hand. For decades, astronomers have observed something puzzling. Galaxies spin faster than they should. According to Newton and Einstein, the visible matter in stars and gas isn't enough to hold these galaxies together. They should fly apart, yet they don't. The answer lies in something unseen dark matter, an invisible substance that does not emit, absorb or reflect light, but whose presence is betrayed by its gravitational pull. Dark matter is the cosmic glue, the invisible hand guiding the formation and evolution of galaxies and the large-scale structure of the universe. Though we cannot see it, gravity reveals it by the way it tugs on visible matter. We know that about 85% of all matter in the universe is dark matter, yet its nature remains one of the greatest mysteries in modern physics. It doesn't interact through electromagnetism, making it elusive and difficult to detect directly. Its discovery has revolutionized our understanding of gravity. It forces us to confront the limits of what we know, suggesting that gravity may work differently on the largest scales, or that unknown particles permeate the cosmos. In this dance of the cosmos, dark matter leads unseen but never silent. Gravity is the force that reveals its presence, whispering secrets of the universe's hidden mass and compelling us to explore deeper. Gravity and the fate of the universe. Gravity is not just a force of attraction. It is the ultimate arbiter of the universe's destiny. The balance between gravity and the mysterious force known as dark energy will determine whether the cosmos will expand forever, slow down, or collapse back into a cosmic finale. In the earliest moments, gravity worked tirelessly to pull matter together, forming stars, galaxies, and clusters. But as the universe expanded, something unexpected happened. A repulsive force began to dominate, pushing space itself apart. This force, called dark energy, opposes gravity on cosmic scales. If gravity is strong enough to overcome dark energy, 
the universe could eventually stop expanding and begin to collapse in a big crunch, compressing everything back into a dense state. Alternatively, if dark energy remains dominant, the universe will expand forever, growing colder and emptier, a heat death. Scientists are still unravelling this cosmic tug of war, using telescopes and satellites to measure how fast the universe is expanding and how gravity behaves across vast distances. Gravity's role in the fate of the universe reminds us that we live within a dynamic, evolving cosmos. It is both the architect of cosmic structures and the force that shapes the universe's ultimate future. A future we continue to explore with wonder and awe. Gravity's role in everyday life. <laughs> Though we often think of gravity as a cosmic force shaping galaxies and black holes, it is also the constant companion of our everyday existence. It is gravity that keeps our feet firmly planted on the ground, governs the flow of rivers and orchestrates the cycle of the seasons. Without gravity, the atmosphere would drift away into space, making Earth inhospitable to life. It pulls water into oceans and rivers, shaping landscapes through erosion and sedimentation. It guides the flight of birds and the arc of a thrown ball. Gravity also affects our bodies on a deeper level. Our muscles and bones have evolved under its steady pull. Astronauts in microgravity experience muscle atrophy and bone loss, revealing just how vital gravity is to our health. Even time itself, warped by gravity, as we explored earlier, plays out subtly in our daily lives. The clocks in your smartphone and... GPS satellites tick at different rates because of gravity's influence. In this way, gravity is not just a distant cosmic force, it is the unseen hand shaping every moment, every breath, every heartbeat. It binds us to the earth and connects us to the vast universe beyond. Gravity, the invisible force that binds us all, gravity is more than just a force, it is the thread weaving the cosmic tapestry, the invisible architect shaping everything from the tiniest particle to the vastest galaxy. It governs the rise and fall of stars, the dance of planets, and even the flow of time itself. Through gravity, we glimpse the profound unity of the universe, where space, time, matter and energy are intertwined in an elegant cosmic ballet. It is a force both familiar and mysterious, humble in everyday life, yet majestic on a universal scale. As we continue to explore gravity from the depths of black holes to the edge of the observable universe, we are reminded of our place within this grand design. We are part of a universe governed by laws that are as beautiful as they are profound. Thank you for joining me on this journey through the force that holds everything together. If you enjoyed this deep dive into gravity, please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a cosmic exploration. Until next time, keep looking up because the universe is always inviting us to wonder from watching. Thank <laughs> you.